Good Wednesday afternoon, everyone. It's a nice day out there across the area. Warm, sunny, a little breezy looking out over Myrtle Beach right now. You can see some of that sea fog off in the distance. That's just because the ocean temperatures are much colder than our air temperatures. But as we look at the boardwalk camera, you can see those sunny skies out there across the area. And again, just a light breeze, but no clouds out there besides that sea fog. So if you're taking a walk out on the beach, it should be fine. You'll just see a little bit of that fog off in the distance. Some of your headlines, sun, sunny and warm today. We do have some record warmth, not only today, but also tomorrow. And then we're going to be watching a cold front move into the area for your Friday. That'll set up for kind of a cooler Friday, but a much cooler Saturday for the area. Right now, temperatures are in the 70s along the coast. Georgetown, you're at 79. Conway at 79. Lorenberg and Lumberton, you're at 78 there in Florence. 71. Darlington at 70. So you can kind of see everybody in the 70s. A few of us already approaching 80 degrees here at the noon hour. High pressure in control. That's keeping all the showers and thunderstorms and even snow up to our north. And that'll control our weather, not only for today, but also for tomorrow. You can see that strong southerly flow this evening. Just a few fair weather clouds out there later on tonight. Tomorrow morning, we'll start off with a few clouds, but then that strong southerly flow kicks back in and we'll see mostly sunny skies. As that front approaches our area, it kind of washes out, so we don't see anything for your Thursday and Friday besides a few stray showers on your Friday afternoon. It's honestly Saturday when we're watching another low pressure system develop, and that'll give us some rainy conditions, especially Saturday afternoon. So if you do have any plans Saturday afternoon, prepare for that. It's out of here by Sunday, and we start to warm back up into the 60s and 70s. So we do have some records in jeopardy today. We're forecasting a high of 75 in North Myrtle Beach. That would tie a record. We're forecasting a high of 84 in Florence. That would obviously break that record. Also forecasting a high of 83 in Lumberton, and that would break the record of 79. So we'll be monitoring that this afternoon, and Frank will have an update on any records that were broken today. If you're heading out to Coastal Carolina tonight for the uh, baseball game, number 21 NC State coming into town. We'll start off at 80 degrees under mostly clear skies. We'll fall through the 70s into the upper 60s under those clear skies. So a great evening to get out there and enjoy the baseball game. Hopefully Coastal can pull off the win. So this afternoon we're watching those pollen levels and you can see we are going to be extremely high. We'll watch these pollen levels on Saturday. If we get enough rainfall, I expect those to fall a little bit. But uh, with the warm air and the gusty winds, it's going to bring in the pollen as well. Southwest winds, 10 to 20 miles per hour. That water temperature at 57 degrees, that's why we have that sea fog out there. And as we look at the seven-day forecast, we'll see temperatures in the 70s. Have that rain chance on Saturday, bumping the temperature down to 60. But once we get past Saturday, we'll see those temperatures warm back up into the 70s along the beach, back up into the mid to upper 70s in our inland communities next.